Hello my lovelies, welcome to my channel. Here we are doing the middle of the month love readings. This is going to be for Leo, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus. How are you doing Leo? I hope you guys are doing amazing. I'm not sure if you guys have been feeling the energies. Uh, there's been definitely a shift of energy that has been occurring the past two weeks. I'm definitely going to be doing a video in regards to that. But anyway, so let's get into your reading Leo. Let's see what Spirit has for you guys. In regards to love and romance for this month. Okay, one more. Let's get into it. Your first card here is the Seven of Pentacles, the Four of Wands, the Six of Cups, the Queen of Pentacles, and the Three of Swords. Partners cards, Princess of Swords, the Sun, the Ace of Wands, the king of swords and the full card wow all right and i happen to look at the bottom of the card the bottom deck um and we have the seven of wands so we have two sevens here uh leo what's going on you're experiencing a lot of spiritual movement right now um because we do have two sevens this is an indication to me of uh, your angel spirit guides um, being around you or trying to guide you, trying to give you that push that you need. With the seven of pentacles here and the four of wands, um, I definitely do see you kind of fantasizing or uh, this could even be like not necessarily fantasizing but daydreaming a lot about your future, about what you want. Um, there's almost like a desire to create or make your own home uh is what i'm hearing so for some of you guys this could be the desire to want marriage the desire to want kids uh for others of you uh just solidifying what you would consider to be stability uh whether it's being in a long-term committed relationship or whether it be marriage whatever the situation is i do see you reminiscing or thinking a lot about the past and i do see a specific individual looking into you so this could be a person from your past that is either looking at your social medias that is uh, wanting to see exactly what's going on with you there is almost like this um feeling of some type of blockage it could be that you physically blocked them on social media or that you chose not to communicate with them whatsoever or that you blocked them on your phone um but there's definitely a desire here to want to revisit the past and I feel that for some of you guys, you may be feeling a bit confused if you are experiencing like uh, dreams or if you're experiencing like thinking of them randomly. Um, and there's almost like this feeling of like, why are they popping in my head so often? It's because you're picking up on their energy. Um, with the Queen of Pentacles here, what they're telling you, grounding is very important right now. Don't make any decisions or any changes or any decision making in general um if you feel like that's not really what you want as an example um if you feel like you are you know feeling a certain type of way you're thinking of your ex or you're thinking of the person you dated five years ago whatever the situation is and all of a sudden they reach out or they try to contact you uh don't feel like you you know it must be destiny or don't feel like um, I should respond because, you know, I was just thinking of them a couple of days ago. It must be that, you know, my guides are trying to tell me something. In reality, what your guides are trying to guide you to understand is that you're picking up on their energy. So the desire to communicate is not necessarily from your part, or it's not that you on a subconscious level want that. It's that they are obsessing over you and you're picking up on that. I hope that makes sense. With the three of swords here, this is definitely a person that either let you down, a person that stepped out of the relationship, or a person that really brought a lot of heartache, a lot of heartbreak to you. Um, and, you know, even if you've convinced yourself that you've overcame that or that you completely have healed from that, there is also a fear of what if, you know, what if that was my person? What if we were meant to be? Again, spirit is telling you, pay attention to that because it has more to do with their energy than the energy that you're actually vibrating from. And the reason we say that is because I do have here the knight, um, sorry, the page of sorts, which indicates to me 
them looking into your situation or looking into your social medias as we do have the sun card here which is your card leo so this is them looking into you or what you're doing ace of wands the desire or the want uh, to start a new beginning to revisit something from the past obviously with the six of cups over here um and it could be a water sorry not a water uh it could be an aries that you're dealing with it can also be a um air energy aquarius libra gemini um but they're definitely overthinking and over analyzing about you and and i'm sensing like obsessively thinking of you um so it could be that they're experiencing a lot of regret they're experiencing remorse um or they're feeling like there is a thin line between love and hate and whatever it is they convince themselves um the reasoning why it didn't work out in the past it's almost like if we can give each other another shot perhaps we can get it right um so i definitely do see the desire there the desire and the want to want to rekindle that um because we do have the ace of wands here which is uh re-inspired or reignited um connection or wanting to revisit a past connection that was very passionate and intense at some point with the full card here the desire for a new beginning so i definitely do feel for a lot of you guys you're going to be experiencing and i want to say from now all the way to the end of september you're going to be experiencing a lot of people from your past popping out reaching out wanting to communicate with you wanting to get your attention that type of energy if there was a recent separation or a recent um giving each other some space or some room they're definitely coming back and they're coming back wanting to offer you something a little bit more solid um only because they understand and they know your worthiness leo and they're not ready to allow you right allow you to step out into the world and get attention um so there is almost like like i said an obsessive type of energy there that is lingering um so I hope this gives you some type of insight, some type of guidance, and I wish you guys the best. We'll see each other soon. Bye.